Hello, this 5 minutes tutorial is part of the OpenAlight 5 minute tutorial and in this section we will continue the previous uh, tutorial that we have covered which is the uh, cup uh, tutorial. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, in case you haven't followed the previous tutorial, I would su strongly suggest that you do so and we will be working with uh, that repository uh, in uh, this tutorial. So in the previous tutorial, we define a uh, cup model, which uh, in this we add a we first define the Yang file and then we compile everything and it auto generated some interfaces, and now we're gonna use the cup provider to implement all those interfaces, uh, specifically the RPC services that uh, defines what actually happens. Uh, so basically, the provider implements uh, the functions that are defined in the cup. <coughs> so as let's go through the Yang file. The first thing is the uh, header that we have here. Uh, Yang version, namespace, it's the same thing uh, that we saw in the cup. Uh, the description. Uh, the only, th only thing that differs is the import. So the, these uh, imports are very important so because uh, we will be using the RPC context, the config, and the open daylight and the binding uh, throughout the uh, in our code or in the uh, cup provider uh, in the open daylight cup. So as you can see, uh, every import has a prefix. So prefix config prefix rpcx and prefix mdsal. Uh, you will see those used uh, uh, all the way in this file, in this uh, the rest of these files. So uh, the first thing I want to go through is the augment uh, choice, the augment, the configuration choice uh, node under module module. So basically we're saying uh, this is a uh, so basically, we are registering our implementation of the cup provider or the cup, and we're saying to uh, MDSAL, hey, I have an implementation, please add that. And we uh, define, we also define cup is called, uh, or any function is called uh, from restconf. And then we have uh, the uh, the uh, cut the number of cups that have that have been made. Uh, this section is only used with GMX call, so this will not be uh, accessible. I think, if I'm not mistaken, this section will not be accessible via RESTConf, but only through uh, GMX call. We'll cover that in another in a, another section. Now let's go through the code. As you can see, it, we have a open daylight code uh, cup, which has been automatically generated. However, the uh, we had to was not generated automatically. <coughs> As we can see, we have the cup service, which was defined in the previous tutorial, auto closable, and data change listener, crop and uh, cup provider runtime MX Bean. I want to uh, give. Uh, I want to emphasize on cup service and data change listener. Those are the uh, the two mo most important uh, implementation that we have in this class. So the basically we implement everything that is uh, the every RPC that is in the cup service. We we define what happens in those function in this class. The other thing that's important is the data change listener. We have a uh, on data change. So basically, when we make calls through via restconf, the on data change uh, is triggered, right? Since we, uh, for instance, if we heat a cup. We change the temperature. We we uh, we tell RESTConf, hey, I want to heat a cup with this temperature, and it trigger on data change, and the on data change will call the heat cup uh, to uh, heat the cup, and then it will um, basically heat the cup and uh, count uh, the number of milliseconds. I think it's uh, depending on the temperature. It will. It will uh, count uh, x number of uh, milliseconds, and when the cup is ready, then uh, we will get an answer. If we translate that uh, directly with the, uh, let's say, a web uh, browser, if you call RESTConf and do a heat cup, you will see your browser. Your browser will be uh, working and doing uh, and waiting for that provider. This is used to uh, uh, read and write data to the MDSL tree. So. 
basically we wrote the cup uh, remember we define a cup that has a remember in the first tutorial we define a cup that was on the top level uh, of uh, everything else so basically 